Welcome to your quick tutorial about navigating virtual career fairs and network events. When you log into your Handshake account, make sure you click into events. When you click into events, you'll see all events that are listed in Handshake, but we're going to particularly click on career fairs. When I click on career fairs, this will navigate me to all the different events that are going on. So I'm going to choose this career fair coming up. When I click on it, this is going to give me some basic information to prepare me, um, contact information if there's any problem, and a list of employers attending. So it's really important that you must click to register. When you click to register, this is going to allow you to sign up for group or one-on-one -on -one sessions with employers you're interested in. So make sure to sign up before they fill up because they will fill very quickly. So I wanted to view the employers. This basically is going to allow you to see the employer sessions um, and how they've set it up. Some employers are doing one-on-one, -on -one, some are doing group sessions, some are doing both. So definitely make sure you sign up um, for one-on-ones. Those are really important to navigate the process. But I'm going to show you how to sign up for your group session. As you can see, one of the companies here is hosting group session from 2.30 to 3. So I'm going to click on their event. And this is basically going to allow me to see what types of opportunity, um, the employment type, authorization, you know, the session time, the year that they're recruiting for, and the job titles. When I click on confirm, this basically will show me right here. This is how you're going to log into that group session, and you'll be able to log in the day of the event and see that in Handshake. So this will give you right here your sessions. So this is how you'll join the video day of. So going back, I'm going to set up a one-on-one -on -one session. So UMY has a one-on-one -on -one session set up. When I click on here, this is going to show me all the available time slots. When I go through this, this will show me the campus recruiter's name. So if you like to look on LinkedIn to get a better sense of who that person is, always good to research that information since it's listed. Um, definitely take a look and research that information about the company and the title and the years that are being recruited for. This will allow you to choose the time that works best for you. Really important. Probably save something on your Google Calendar as a reminder of the time that you need to log in to meet with the recruiter, but definitely sign up as many slots as possible with different employers through the actual fair itself. So when I click on here, this is going to allow me to confirm. Now I've registered for my 101. When I register for the 101, you'll be able to see it here at the top of my session. This is basically going to show you a list as you populate more of the different sessions you're interested in. When you click on your sessions, this basically will show you how to join the video during that time. So really important um, to know that you have to click on this information to, of course, make sure you show up on time, you know, plan your location and have good eye contact. All these things are going to be really, really important the day of the fair. So this basically will give you some article of more tips, which career services will send you more information. So I hope this tutorial helped. Mm -hmm. And if you have questions, you can always email us at boredomfutures at boredom.edu.